Hello everyone, so now I'm going to discuss example 18a. Write the following in the simplest form. So now we are dealing with a third questions. Given the question third 3 plus third 8 bracket square. So the meaning is 2 times. So square root of 3 plus square root of 8 bracket. The meaning of square means that 2 times. So now we are going to expand. Square root of 3 multiply with square root of 3 will equal to 3. Square root of 3 multiply with square root of 8, we will have positive square root of 3 and square root of 8. Next, square root of 8 multiply with square root of 3, we will have positive square root of 3, square root of 8. Finally, Square root of 8 multiply with square root of 8, we will have 8. So, rearrange and simplify the situation. So, 3 plus with 8, we have 11. Plus, we have 2 times the square root of 3 multiply with the square root of 8. Assume this is a terms and this is another terms. So, now we have 2 terms. So the term is square root of 3 multiplied with square root of 8. So the question asks us to write, in the, write the question in simplest form. So from here, we notice that actually we can simplify the square root of 8. For example, square root of 8 is equal to square root of 4 multiplied with 2. Based on the properties, AB can be equals to square root of A multiplied with square root of B. So from here, we have square root of 4 multiplied with square root of 2. So finally, square root of 4 is equals to 2 square root of 2. So from here, we have square root of 3 multiplied with 2 square root of 2. Finally, we have 4 square root of 2 multiply square root of 3. So from here, again, we can simplify that, become 11 plus 4 square root of 6. Now we are going to discuss example 18b. Given that the square root of 3 minus 2 square root of 2 multiply with square root of 3 plus square root of 2. So now we are going to expand. First, we are going to expand square root of 3, multiply with square root of 3, and we will have 3. Followed by square root of 3, multiply with square root of 2, we will have positive square root of 2, multiply with square root of 3. Next, negative 2 square root of 2, multiply with square root of 3, we will have negative 2 square root of 2, multiply with square root of 3. Finally, we are going to expand negative 2 square root of 2 multiply with square root of 2 and we will have negative 2 bracket with 2. Next, we are going to simplify the situation. 3 minus with 4. So we will have negative 1. So assume or let them as a, a term and followed by negative 2 with another terms. So finally, we will have negative square root of 2 multiply with square root of 3. So finally, the final answer would be negative 1, negative square root of 6. So here we are, and thanks for watching.